It's Priscilla's Children's Music Show. I'm Priscilla, here to have fun with you. Get ready for some dancing, rhyming, drawing, and singing. It makes me feel so happy to hear you sing along. Singing, dancing every day makes learning easy on the way. I love to play with music and when I sing a song, it makes me feel so happy if you would sing along. Going to be your music teacher today about the three main needs for music melody rhythm and harmony before we had a note reading system for musicians people sang melodies with syllables like do re mi's if you need a parent to write these out for you it will help write in an ascending hill do re mi fa so, la, ti, do. Try it again. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. That's the basic scale. I'll sing it slowly for you, and then you try it. Ready, sing. Do. Sing it alone. Ready, sing. Now let's try it faster. Ready, sing. Don't ring me for so long. Don't. Now by yourself and sing. Everything in music just takes practice. When you want the notes to come down the hill, you sing it backwards. First, we'll do it slowly. Ready, sing. Do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, ti, do, do, ti. Sing it alone. Ready, sing. Now let's try it faster. Ready, sing. Do re mi fa so la ti do do ti la so la mi re do. Now by yourself and sing. Now you know a basic scale. Many melodies and songs are sung by mixing up the tones of the scale. To help you remember the tones, I have a little game. Once again, if you have these written in order, it helps. We're going to start with Do, adding a new scale name each time and returning to Do, like this. Do, Re, Do. Do, Re, Mi, Re, Do. Do, Re, Mi, Fa, Mi, Re, Do. Now I'll add some music and you can try it with me. Ready, sing. Do, re, do, do, re, mi, re, do, do, re, mi, fa, mi, re, do, do, re, mi, fa, so, fa, mi, re, do, do, re, mi, fa, so, la, so, fa, mi, re, do, do, re, mi, fa, so, la, so, fa, mi, 
When you get better at that, you can try it faster. For more practice and for more melody exercises, look up my album called 28 Basic Ear Training Exercises by Priscilla Candell at Amazon or iTunes.com. Our next music activity is about rhythm. A steady beat helps singers and musicians to stay together. Did you know you have a natural steady beat in your body? Put your hand over your heart and see if you can feel it. Boom, 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 boom. When you're running around, it will go faster, but all the while trying to keep steady. Boom, 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 boom. In our next song, see if you can clap your hands and other movements to a steady beat. Steady beats are felt in many parts of our life. Think of a clock ticking. Tick, tock, tick, tock. That's a steady beat. How about a swing? Swing, 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 swing. Or jumping rope. Jump, 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 jump. I bet you can find other things around you that can have a steady beat. Bouncing balls, chirping crickets. You just need to keep listening for them. In our next song, we're going to play a steady beat. If you have a drum or a box you can use, that would be great. Or you can beat on a table or even on your lap. Let's pretend you're a Native American who's playing their favorite beat. It goes boom, 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 boom. Keep playing that with the next song. important part of music is harmony. That's when you play or sing more than one melody at a time. You might hear do, mi, so, but when you add them all together, you might get this. Do, mi, so. That's harmony. Those three notes formed a chord. 
You can also get harmony by singing certain melodies at different times like this. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Here's a famous song you know, and some extra verses I added. In the last part, listen for me singing the song with different notes for harmonies. The instruments you hear are also playing harmonies called chords. Let's listen and sing along if you can. to combine melody, rhythm, and harmony in this funny song. Yeah. 
Hooray for you if you knew that song. Remember earlier when we were singing about do re mis? Here's a song that we can sing with the do's and the sol's. See if you recognize it. Do do sol sol la la sol fa fa mi mi re re do. Can you guess what that is? Oh, I'm sure you know. Let's sing it together. I might even add some harmony to it. And our music class show. Let's talk about musical instruments. Many instruments playing together form a band or orchestra. They belong to families, just like your family, where you have a dad, mom, and maybe brothers or sisters. Instrument families have a low-voiced dad, a medium-voiced mom, and a higher voice for children. Each family has something in common. The string families look a lot like different size violins, and they all have strings. The brass family are all different sizes and are made out of shiny brass metal. The percussion family are different sizes of drums and other things you hit to play them. The woodwind family started out being made of wooden tubes with holes and now metal keys. And you blow into them, and that's the wood wind. Now today we're going to talk about the woodwind family. The father will be called the bassoon. He is the biggest and sounds like this. <laughs> Next is the mama called the clarinet. She sounds like this. One of the children is called an oboe. Listen. Her child has a higher voice called the flute. It sounds like this. The baby is the highest voice in the orchestra, called the piccolo. Listen. That almost sounds like a bird. Put them all together, and you get this. They really blend together, and it's hard to tell one from another. So when they play in the orchestra, quite often they play in different harmonies or different melodies all put together, and they each can be recognized for their own selves. 
Which woodwind instruments can you hear in this? Did you guess? There were two of them there. One was the big bassoon, and the other was the oboe. Shall we try another and see what you can hear? There were two of them again. One was the same as the last one, the big daddy bassoon, and the other was the very, very high piccolo. Did you guess those? Good for you. Okay, let's do one more. The whole idea of an orchestra is that all the instruments are supposed to blend together, so sometimes it's hard to pick them out. But there was a woodwind instrument in there. Can you tell which one it was? You're right if you guessed the clarinet. It's fun to listen for all the instruments when you know what they sound like. From now on, start listening carefully and see if you can hear a woodwind in there. On another show. We'll learn about some of the other instrument families. Don't forget to look up Pris Candell's YouTube channel, where you can see many of the things we talked about in today's music class show. Well, my friends, it looks like the time is up for Priscilla's kids' songs. I've enjoyed my time with you. The clock is saying time to go. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye. Real soon. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye. Bye to my singing. Bye to my dance. Bye to my music. Goodbye, my friends. Goodbye. Priscilla's Kid Songs available at CDBaby.com, iTunes, or Amazon.com.